What's up everyone? It's G here again. And I thought of just creating this video to uh, give you guys um, how the autofocus of the Canon EOS M50 performs under low light. Well, it's pretty obvious though that uh, the room that I'm in right now isn't well lit. Actually, I only have uh, this one lamp here uh, on my right. You can still see on my screen that I'm still in focus. Of course, as long as I just move within the horizon, I'd be in focus. But if I move, you know, as quick as that here at the front and then suddenly at the back, I know that I'm still in focus because I can still see that um, square that's fixated on on my face and it's pretty amazing now what I'm gonna try to do here is I'm gonna take this camera so I'd like to show you um, the lighting condition that I have here in the room so there's no fluorescent light shadow lampshade that I have here in my table on my table and that's really it you know so I'm gonna try to walk around and see how you know it tries to perform now what's pretty amazing here is the way it changes its ISO because everything all of the settings that I have here are shot uh, using the automatic setting uh, there's continuous autofocus uh, the ISO is set to automatic so as you can see it I mean the the face my face is being lit up you know quite well um, I'm gonna try to move here probably let's go behind uh, the light source so right now I can see that my face isn't that well lit it's pretty dark actually and a little noisy um, and that's really because of the automatic uh, ISO setting that I placed or that I selected uh, up to 12,000 actually so it's I mean it's really dark in here but I would say that from a vla vlogging standpoint that the video is still usable um, I mean yeah and again just going back to the autofocus you know I put it this close like or the distance that I have between my face and this camera so this right so I don't know that's about uh, I don't know five or six inches so there right now it's out of focus it tries to uh, you know look at uh, tries to uh, find my face if I uh, click my face on the screen now it's in focus so very rare that, that it really does that for the most part I mean I would say 95% of the time you will really find your face in focus <sighs> my thoughts as far as the autofocus go I mean it's it's really right up there um, I don't know which camera can actually match the um, the autofocus power that uh, the Canon cameras have um, at this price point I think there's I don't there's really not a lot of cameras that it, that can really match the the dual pixel autofocus that Canon EOS M50 has and I think that the rest of the other cameras that that have that uh, technology try to do I'll uh, turn off the the lampshade and you know just have my laptop uh, you know be the, the be the light source let's see what happens <laughs> oh, only the light that's coming from the screen uh, it's providing the the light source so right now I can still see it's uh, that I'm in focus 
pretty close to my laptop uh, let me go to uh, let's say uh, about 10 feet away from the light source it's still in focus is it nope I lost the the square mark yep it's not there anymore and it's back in focus so I go to uh, like 14 feet now probably I still have the square locked on my face but uh, yeah the, the it's really dark already I can still see uh, you know a little bit of my face but that's really about it so let me walk three feet close to my screen and there I go I have really no complaints I mean I tried to think of anything but at this point there's none I'm just really loving it thanks guys for watching and uh, see you on my next videos ah!